Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Coach Evans, and today we're going to talk about the five sacks the Ravens got Sunday versus the Browns. Um, watching from last year, and we didn't get a lot of sacks, didn't get a lot of turnovers, but the fact that we are creating ways, innovative ways to get sacks, it's really exciting. Um, could have been more, but we got five this week. Let's look at each sack and how it actually happened. Roll the intro. Again, before we start, I want to shout out these guys that were major con contributors to the channel. Uh, you read the names up there. I'm not going to go through them, but if you see your name, shout it out. And again, I got to add one more name to it. I'm going to do that in the morning. Let's get into the film. Let's look at the five sacks. And this is the first one. Uh, they're on the, what, 15-yard line? Now, I remember the announcer saying in the game, there's no safeties back there. Where are the safeties? Both of them on the line of scrimmage. Geno Stone and Kyle Hamilton, both of them on the line of scrimmage. And see, so we got seven up front. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But we're only going to bring five. Kalea's going to drop out. And always going to do this little tango with uh, Njoku right there. But look at Kyle Hamilton. Watch Kyle Hamilton don't is he gets in on the set, but watch his pass rush move. Why he got pass rush moves and somebody else don't? Whoop, whoop, look at that. That's so fluid. And Hamilton kind of gets down the back end. But did you see his rip? Did you see Hamilton's rip? That's the crazy part. That a safety can do this. Probably just off natural ability. Simple. Warren. To beat the guard already. To beat the guard already. Now Stone gets some being to come around the back end. But that pressure was put on him by Hamilton. Good sack right there. Let's go to sack number two. They're driving on their 40. Or our 40. Did they roll out? And thing is, uh, Houston just sticks with it. Houston just stays with it, doesn't give up on the pursuit, and end up getting a sack. Really much a coverage sack. Let, let's, I forgot about that part. That look. Let's see what the coverage looked like. They got three people in the route. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people defending. He's defended. Uh, they might can get it there, but he's defending on the back end. So, this is a good coverage sack. And Houston just stays with it. Just kept fighting, you know, till he got to the QB. There's Justin right there on your left side of your screen. Against, uh, I think that's Willis for the Browns. And he's really just trying to set the edge because it's rollout. But he just, you know, kind of sticks with it. And look, there could have been a sack right there, but somebody missed. I don't know who that is, though. Oh, yeah, we know who it is. Next play. Sack number three. Only rushing four, which I like. Only rushing four. We never got pressure with four last year. Never. Never. It's such a blessing to be able to not have to blitz all the time and get pressure on the QB. Again, this is Oway. I mean, not Oway. This is Houston. The very next play after that first set. The very next play. And Joku's going to bump him to give him more of an angle. But look right there. He's going to take Jesse Willis' hands and just erase them. Watch. Just erase his hands. Sometime today. Now, that's one move. Look at the rip. Look at the rip. The remnants of the rip. That's the second move. That's two moves in a span of... And get to the QB and knock it out. Look at Yoda. I think he only played 17 snaps. And had two sacks. Could have had a third. 
It's crazy. Again, yeah, getting that bend around the edge with the two moves real quick. The wrist slap, the wrist slap, then the rip. Just that quick. Let's go to the next one. It looks like a traditional what? Three four. But watch Queen. Watch Queen. You know, widen out and kind of gives the the element that he has one of these gaps. And I think that's just enough for the center to take his eyes off of him. And then he shoots that gap right there. Initially misses. Thinks Bynes has a sack. Then Bynes misses. Then Queen go clean it up. Bynes sitting there like, oh, man. I missed one. I should have had one. But this is something a guy used to work for. He, used to, he just called it backers cross. Queen's going to go first. Bynes going to go behind him. And it's just literally... Backers cross. They're going to, you know, split the A-gaps. But with the center shuffling to his right, he left that A-gap wide open. Chubb missed it. That was a terrible chip by Chubb, too. And then Queen Queen filled it up. Or cleaned it up, rather. Queen him out of BK. And the last sack. Again, seven up front. Looks like we're going to bring seven. Giving that, that threat. But we don't. We're going to drop out and play 303 deep. Watch out Kyle Hamilton walls off in Joku. Kyle Hamilton going to wall off this receiver right here from right there. And that's the zones everybody got. Pepe is going to, I think this is Pepe. Whoever this is going to come up. Take that. Now you got three deep, three under. He's walled off. He's really in no man's land. And can't do much about it right there. But look what's going on in the backfield. There's already heat on him. You got this. Uh, he's winning. He's winning. But when we look at the backfield, we can see. A bit more of who, who is that that's winning. It's really the two old cats. It's Calais Campbell and Justin Houston. Houston swipes at the ball but misses it. Calais Campbell reach out, reaches out and gets it. Those are the two old cats. Older cats. You got one move by Calais. Kind of didn't work. Another move with the arm over. So that's two moves right there. Houston just winning with speed on the edge. He got a rip. Got a rip. He misses. Calais don't miss. Ball's out. Oway gets the um the fumble recovery. Speaking of Oway, let's check out Oway on this play. A lot of people say he gets double teamed and whatnot. Well, this is a solo block versus Willis. Where's the moves? I don't, I don't see a move. I mean, that's spinning back, but you're only spinning back because you rushed past the quarterback. So you got to spin back to that level. I, I don't see, I don't even see attempted moves. But I digress. We're going we gonna to let it be. And we, we not, I'm not going to bash Oway today. We're gonna, just going to let it be. And, you know, I'm going to end it on that. I appreciate you guys for coming out. You could have been anywhere in the world, but you chose to be here with me. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, see you later on today. Enjoy your good Tuesday. Peace.